Spring hasn't really felt like spring this year for producers in South Dakota as snow continued to fly well into April. With all the snow on the ground, planting season will be delayed for many producers. Equipment that would normally be in the field is under snow banks at Todd Hanton's farm in Goodwin. And every year that's our goal to get in and get some spring wheat planted by April 11th. And most years we've gotten that accomplished and some years we've had it all in and planted by April 11th, our spring wheat. That's definitely not going to happen this year. This year, Hanton's farm got over 55 inches of snow, the most they've had since 1997. That year we were late on planting, but we did get everything planted. So I'm hopeful and positively thinking that we will get things planted. Last year, Hanton faced issues with moisture flooding out his fields, causing him to have to plant some sections of field multiple times, which is something he fears could happen again this year. Yeah, very worried about that. We had to make several trips to fields to that areas were um, able to be planted, but then we had to come back and plant them again and again in some circumstances, which messes it up for the spraying and the harvest and everything. But in other areas of the state, conditions before this spring were extremely dry, and this moisture will help set producers up for success. Yeah, I think the soil moisture that we're going to get from the spring, from snowmelt and precipitation in general, uh, can carry us quite a bit into the summer season and hopefully protect us from at least extreme drought um, for the beginning to middle part of the growing season of the summer preparing the possible planting challenges and working to get into the field as soon as possible. With the knowledge of that we've accumulated that uh, early planting really makes a difference, this spring is looking like that's going to make it tough and, and it makes you anxious to want to get it in as early as you can, but you just can't push it in those wet conditions. In a normal year, Hanton usually likes to get the spring wheat planted by April 11th, corn planted by May 1st, and the soybeans in by the first couple days of May. Thanks for watching Ag Week TV on YouTube. Make sure to like and subscribe. We put out new videos every Saturday.